What is up? So hopefully you can see, dude. I'm, I'm in my car. Today's gonna be a car video. Haven't filmed like in a stupid long time, dude. My apologies. Basically, me uh, reviewing my Borla Tech. If y'all don't know, uh, I got a couple. Hold on. Yeah, so I got a couple of subscribers. So if y'all don't know, dude, I got a 2017 Camaro 2SS, right? And I got this Borla Attack, and the lighting's pretty bad right here. But yeah, um, I got this Borla Attack axle back, probably like. Mm, 15,000 miles ago. My car is pretty much like at 30. I got the Borla Attack axle back, I think like around 13 miles or whatever. And pretty much uh, like 15,000. The thing might be a little bit crooked, dude. My apologies, but it's really just y'all can hear it. Hold on. Low downshifts and whatnot. Hold on, hold on. Wait for it. Oh my goodness. But yeah, um, pretty much in this review, hopefully y'all can see me pretty good. I always forget to... Uh, Put clips of the car, you know, so you can hear it and stuff. I'm trying to make this thing pop. Hey, I'll listen to this. Hold on. <laughs> oh my goodness, dude. Track mode is probably the best mode for like the loudest revs, I think. Awesome, man. So talking about the exhaust, man, you've seen like hopefully like little drive-by clips and stuff like that. But here's the idle sound, just what it sounds idle. I do need to clean my tips, ignore that, but just listen to this. Borla attack. Sounds pretty good, dude. Idle. You know, it's not like super duper duper loud, but it's like loud enough so you can hear it. I don't think. Why is there a bad glare right there? Nah, but it's loud enough to the point where like, you can hear the car like 
I think it's nice like in the middle not too loud not too um, quiet but I think it's pretty good dude all right man so hopefully you enjoyed those uh, drive-by shots of the car does this help at all let me see let me see it does make it a little bit brighter man but it just makes me look like stupid 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 bright let's go ahead and close that what if we just brighten this up all right but man uh basically just to jump into the conversation about is the boiler attack worth it but before we get into this video man y'all seen those driving clips i might insert them now <laughs> Maybe before, maybe after. I'm not too sure, man. I got a Borla Attack axle back, and then also got the Borla, um, like the mid downpipe setup, you call them, with the secondary cat delete. So that's the sound you get. And though I think it's worth it, I think the, um, let me try to get different angles and whatnot. The Borla Attack, the axle back, I got that first. I think that was like $1,800, dude. So my whole setup is 18 plus like 12. That's like what? Uh, one plus one, two, eight plus two, 10. So that's like about 3,000, I guess, as far as my exhaust system goes so far. Plus, like, installation and stuff. But is it worth it? Honestly, dude, when you get this type of sound, hold on, hold on. When you get that sound all the time, especially, like, when it's cold outside in the mornings, when you get the cold start, and when you get to start the car up and it sounds like that super loud, I'm like, oh, my goodness. It's really the best thing ever. So in conclusion, dude, is this exhaust system that I have worth it? Uh, I think so. It sounds really, really, really good. It has like the NPP things, which if you don't know, that's pretty much you can, um, you can like open the valves and close them. So right now, I don't know if you can see it. Let's lock the doors real quick. Maybe some weirdos or something around here. But um, pretty much the car is in track mode, right? All right, now you change this right there, bam. Now it's in sport, now it's in touring mode. And pretty much what that NPP exhaust thing is, is when it's in touring mode the npp is pretty much you got two i got two on this side two on this side and one is always open one exhaust tip is open on both sides when it's in touring mode but when you pop that thing in the sport or track everything opens up you get the full sound for everything so that's really cool just to have i mean most most of the time my car is in sport mode it is in track mode so it's always like open like all the time so some people are going to be like so some people may be like so what's the point of having that ability when it's always open and honestly it's it's just really nice to have really to show your friends like hey uh look pop them open and then close them and stuff yeah so that's pretty cool but like other than that dude it's always in sport mode and just in conclusion dude i think it's a good exhaust if you're on the fence about getting it should i get boiler should i just get like a, a muffler delete i i mean muffler delete sounds good but i think you get a whole bunch of drone like that loud noise inside the car when you're driving and this one you can still hear it like when i rev it make sure it's in uh, track mode i mean you can still hear it but it's not super loud where like if you have someone here and you're talking trying to have a conversation it's not gonna like mess up the conversation it's not that loud but i feel like if you get like a mid um i mean a muffler delete I feel like you'll have like a bunch of drone and you'll just hear a whole bunch of stuff inside the car in the cabin while you're driving. So really it sounds good, but you're gonna have like a bunch of noise inside. So uh, really just save up and get an exhaust. I'm not sponsored by Boiler or Corsa, or none of that. Just uh, a YouTube video, I figured why not. These car videos always do super, like I wouldn't say they go like viral or nothing, but they, the car videos do better than like my normal videos I do. So uh, I'm gonna try to do more car videos, man. Let me show you that idle one more time. Dude, it's stupid hot outside right now. Oh my goodness. If it, it says 88, but I think it's way, way, way hotter than 88 degrees, honestly, dude. This is what I was talking about, the NPP. I think this one, let me try to see if I can see it. You can't see it, but pretty much one is always open on both sides. But um, I got mine on sport mode or track. I forgot which one I have it in right now. So really, both are open. Both are open here. Really so you get like the full, full experience, the full sound of the car, man. But yeah, if anybody, if you want to see any other uh, car videos, man, definitely, definitely let me know, dude. Just because um, 
I don't think it's a pretty cool car. Right, it's summertime, like I said. But uh, yeah, I think that's gonna be it for this video, man. Let's get a thumbnail with the car. <laughs> but um, yeah, I think that's gonna be it for this video. If you enjoyed it, man, let's go into the car real quick. It's too hot out here. But yeah, really not much else to talk about, man. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you did, man, leave it a fat, fat, fat like, man. And just stay tuned. Hella new content dropping soon. All that good stuff, man. So, see you on the next video. So, yeah. Uh, uh. I be dripping.